it's going to be a busy week for me with meetings here and there but first things first i need to glam up so i've got a very full eyebrow or is the eyebrow or eyebrow and i do not intend to shave it the annoying part of making up is the transformation like why can't we all just look this way and then again after washing it off you find it hard to reckon with the real you, your real face, so annoying. Guys, I don't like makeup, to be honest with you. I'd rather go without it. Since I have to come on camera, and I'm going to meet up with someone, why not? Thinking about 2020, so far, to be honest, 2020 is a year that a lot of people lost hope due to slow business movements, loss of job, death of a loved one because of the pandemic. It's been one scary year. But to me, it's a new phase in my life where I'm learning to take control, total control, calling the shot, leaving on my own terms, scheduling meetings and whatnot. Such a scary move. <laughs> After a long day, I had lunch at Meraki restaurant and lounge in Bellanova and was I blown away? <laughs> Take a look at how classy and exotic it looked. is absolutely mad great service and to think of the fact that you could see the whole town from the roof and it's quite beautiful at night I don't know if I'm going to stay till night time so come have the time of your life right here My food came, yippee! 
the moment of truth has just arrived <laughs> now let's talk about the lemon marinated basmati rice with those mouth watering prawns tasty i dare say but considering the price we paid that portion of rice was too small for 12k forget it i'm a foodie but i'm saying that that portion of rice was actually too small for that price regardless of the fact that it was a price for the prawns and the rice was just the side dish i repeat the rice was just a side dish what can i say i mean like if you've got it spend it if not you could get someone to spend it on you you know a win-win situation but all in all it was great it was a great view so if you're looking to relax somewhere with friends lovers or families then this is where you ought to be it gives you that view that makes you think that you could take on the world it's beautiful three days I don't know what I ate but <clears throat> I had to just go to H medics for um taps and whatnot <laughs> having running nose and I'm tired like <clears throat> I'm hoping it's not COVID God. Right now I need to go eat. I'm hungry. I just finished taking um having my nose swipe for the COVID test. Um <clears throat> let me locate where to eat. Yeah, these are my tablets, but I have to wait till like 5:30 for my um test. Because I had to do a blood test um, to ascertain what's currently happening in my body. This is about the second time I'm treating for malaria. <clears throat> I really don't know what the problem is. But all the same, I have a bitter taste in my mouth. So all of these things just give me worries and I need to know what's happening. <clears throat> Spending money, but money that I don't have but it's, it's very necessary for me to do this test. So yeah, let's go. Can you imagine when I just got the results and all the doctors have gone home? Not all, um, apart from the emergency doctors and you have to pay like 6K to see them. And I'm like, oh wow. So I have to go home and then come back tomorrow morning so that my results can be read. I'm just hoping that COVID result comes out negative. Yes, so <coughs> this is where we are at. 
I'm waiting for my Uber driver to arrive. I think he's the one coming right now. Uh, I need to go home. I'm tired. My head is aching and whatnot. Taxify? Okay. So, guys. <sighs> going on. Please, can you put on your mask? All right, then. Good evening. All the time. Oh, oh. God. If you guys are not watching Big Brother Saturday Night Party, you're missing. stand up now i don't want to stand up all right guys i need to go like share comment if you love what i dish out